Okay, it's five after seven, so we're going to get started. Good evening, everyone. My name is Jacqueline Morgan. I'm the Director of Membership for Girl Scouts of Suffolk County. Before we begin, I'd like to invite you to set your Zoom preference uh, to active speaker. That way, um, everybody will be engaged and you'll see everybody who's speaking. Thank you for joining us tonight on this momentous occasion as we recognize our 2020 in 2021 Goals Award Girl Scouts. Our girls have done extraordinary work and we are so very proud of all of them. At this time, please join me in welcoming Girl Scouts of Suffolk County's Interim President and CEO, Tammy Severino. Tammy, you're muted. I mean, it's unmuted. <laughs> Of course I am. Of course I am. So three sentences in, not too terrible. <laughs> it was loud around. Recording in progress. Thank you, Jackie. And if you're just joining us, please take a moment to set your Zoom view preference to active speaker mode. You can locate this option at the top right corner of your screen. Good evening, everyone. Let me first say congratulations to our 31 Gold Award Girl Scouts. As everyone here knows, the Gold Award is the highest award a girl can earn in Girl Scouting. The young women we're honoring this evening will become the strong, confident leaders of tomorrow. As many of these young women can tell you, the Gold Award is a journey, sometimes a long and challenging one. It takes dedication, planning, and plenty of hard work. We are here tonight because these young women have successfully completed their journey, and in doing so, they have touched many lives. They have inspired their families, their friends, other Girl Scouts, and all of us. Their projects have served a need in their communities. These young women have made a difference in the lives of those beyond the circle of family and friends. They have reached out and bestowed a gift on all of us. One of the things we promise as Girl Scouts is to make the world a better place. There is no greater example of the fulfillment of that promise than the young women who are here tonight. At this time, I would like to invite Donna Smealand, Girl Scouts of Suffolk County's Chair of the Board, to continue with the program. Thank you, Tammy. Good evening, everyone. Tonight, we see the faces of our extraordinary Gold Award Girl Scouts who have distinguished themselves with their efforts. But we also see the faces of all of those who have worked with them and helped them along the way. We owe a great deal of gratitude to all of you who have offered your assistance and advice to our Gold Award girls. Parents, friends, leaders, teachers, family members, and all others who were a part of the Gold Award process. For more than 50 years, volunteers and leaders like those here tonight from Girl Scouts of Suffolk County have been guiding girls to achieve the ultimate in Girl Scouting, the Gold Award. Your dedication to the Girl Scout mission and your unwavering service are an inspiration to all of us. Without you, we would be unable to serve our girls. And so we'd like to extend our sincere thanks and appreciation to all of you, to all of our Girl Scout volunteers and everyone who is here this evening. At this time, I'd like to invite Tammy to continue with the program. Thank you, Donna. This evening, we're honored to play a very special message from Judith Batty, Interim Chief Executive Officer for Girl Scouts of the United States of America. In August of 2020, Judith made history when she became the first black woman to assume the CEO role at Girl Scouts of the USA. A lifetime member, Judith grew up in Girl Scouting, starting as a Brownie and continuing through the senior level, later serving as a junior troop co-leader and member of the national board. Judith's lifelong dedication to Girl Scouting is an extraordinary and inspiring uh, example for all of us. It is my great pleasure to introduce the following message from the Interim Chief Executive Officer for Girl Scouts of the USA, Judith Batty. Hello, Girl Scouts of Suffolk County. I'm Judith Batty, Interim CEO of Girl Scouts of the USA. I am so excited that 30 of you have earned your Gold Award this year. You are now officially Gold Award Girl Scouts. Congratulations. Throughout this year, you have shown incredible resilience, creativity, and strength, and nothing has demonstrated this more than the effort you put forth to complete your projects and earn your Gold Award. 
the greatest achievement in Girl Scouting. All of your projects have met express needs in your community, and they have challenged you to excel in the areas of leadership and service. You met challenges head on, and the skills and experiences you have gained in the process have set the foundation for a lifetime of active citizenship. Congratulations again, and I wish you all the best as you take the next step in your life's journey. Enjoy your celebration. That was wonderful. At this time, I invite Jackie to continue with the program. Thank you, Tammy. In a few moments, we'll be acknowledging our dignitaries who have joined us this evening. But before we do, we'd like to play a few short videos from those dignitaries who are unable to be with us this evening. Hi, I'm Lieutenant Governor Kathy Hope, and I'm so pleased to join you virtually to celebrate the 31 Girl Scouts of Suffolk County who are receiving gold awards today. The gold award is a prestigious honor that reflects the perseverance and hard work necessary to attain the highest level of Girl Scouts. This achievement will open doors to scholarships, higher education, and career opportunities. And I know each and every one of you knows how to lead like a girl. You're go-getters, innovators, risk takers, and leaders. And I know that every one of you will make meaningful contributions to your communities and indeed the world. As the highest ranking female statewide elected official in New York State, I try to encourage young women and girls to achieve their highest potential. And as the mother of a former Girl Scout, I know the Scouts help build courage, confidence and character. These qualities will help you become the strong leaders that we need in our state and in our country. Congratulations on your gold awards. You should be very proud of this major recognition. Thank you. Good evening. My name is Senator Mario Matera and it's my pleasure to be able to join you for this special event. Thank you to the Girl Scouts of Suffolk County for inviting me to join you tonight. The gold award is truly a special award that takes tremendous dedication and you should be very proud of all your accomplishments. As you celebrate this milestone, Please remember the role that your parents and scout leaders have played in helping you along the way. This is a special day for all of you. While I am impressed by all of today's gold award recipients, it is my personal honor to acknowledge the scouts who reside in my second Senate district. Josie Hudson, Jenna Forrest Rero, Rebecca Hoover, Elena Rubino, Margaret Magaliano, Nina Ritter, Isabella Mule, Natalie Perazzi, Christine Pullman, Gianna Derenbacher, Ava McGovern. Congratulations to all of you and have a good night. Hi, I'm Rob Colarco, presiding officer of the Suffolk County Legislature, and I'm here today to congratulate all of the young ladies who have achieved the Gold Award in Scouting in the Girl Scouts this year. You know, achieving this milestone is a real accomplishment and shows your dedication both to the Girl Scouts, but to your community and to all the different wonderful things that you did to be able to achieve this award. Whether it's giving time to your community, raising money for an important organization, or whatever it may be, you have committed yourselves, you have shown true leadership, you have marshaled the resources of your community to come behind a cause, and you've done great work. And these are the skills they will lead you into the future and make you great leaders in all that you try to accomplish. So congratulations to each and every one of you and well done. Hi, I'm Suffolk County Legislator Bridget Fleming and it's my pleasure to extend congratulations to two Girl Scout Gold Award recipients in the second legislative district, Jessica Kaplan of East Hampton High School and Julie Kramberg of Southampton High School. As a member of Girl Scout Troop 663, Jessica created a public service video for her gold project to raise awareness about the volunteer firefighters in our local communities. Jessica's project falls under the public safety theme. For her gold project with Troop 662, Julie partnered with Southampton Animal Shelter to set traps for feral cats to be caught, neutered, and possibly 
adopted or released. Her project, of course, falls under the theme of animals. Well done, Jessica and Julie. Your projects are much needed in our community. Thank you and congratulations for being 2021 Suffolk County Girl Scouts Gold Award recipients. My office is preparing proclamations to honor your achievements, and I look forward to presenting them to each of you in person. Congratulations. Congratulations to Catherine Carrillo from Mount Sinai High School, Sarah Insalata from Comsawag High School, and Ava McGovern from Ward Melville High School. There are few community events as important as recognizing and celebrating the extraordinary achievement of our youth. Congratulations, girls. If you learn the rewards of being involved in your community while young, you are more likely to stay involved throughout your life. You are in exceptional position to take action and make our world a better place. By taking action, you have inspired others and are defining what it means to be a leader in the community. Your community service projects have had far reaching effects in our community and beyond. Please continue to stay involved and make a difference. Girl Scout Gold Award is such an exceptional achievement. Congratulations. And congratulations to the parents of these fabulous Girl Scout Gold recipients. I know how much love and support it takes from you to make this possible for them. Thank you to all of the exceptional leaders and mentors as well. Congratulations, girls, and keep making a difference. Hi, I'm Sarah Anker, your Suffolk County Legislator for District 6. I want to thank all the girls for uh, participating in the Girl Scouts and congratulations on the many gold awards that will be presented tonight. Um, I want to also give a great big shout out to Shannon Regan as she is from my district and she is also earning her gold award. Uh, she has uh, created a manual on how to be a nicotine cessation telephone supporter and she made two pamphlets for Stony Brooks tobacco cessation program and I'm so proud of her because again all those folks that are able to quit smoking will live longer healthier happier lives so again thank you so much for the parents uh, for the many scout leaders uh, and for the mentors that have provided uh, some inspiration uh, knowledge uh, and just the understanding that what you do for your community truly makes a difference Thank you so much. Hi, this is Suffolk County Legislator Anthony Pigrell, and I want to thank you for letting me be part of this ceremony today. I want to give a big congratulations to all the girls who earned their gold star. What an achievement. You are our future leaders, and I'm going to be looking on your future endeavors and successes with a close eye. Thank you for all your hard work and dedication within the Girl Scouts. I wish you luck, and hopefully we'll see each other soon. Thanks, and have a great day. Hi, I'm Suffolk County Legislator Sam Gonzalez. I am so proud to be here before you today, especially to acknowledge the Girl Scout Gold Award. The Girl Scout Gold Award is the highest honor uh, one can achieve in Girl Scouting. And so the young women who earn this award exemplify the values of leadership, uh, character, and service that are the heart and soul of the Girl Scouts. And today I am proud to give a certificate of achievement from the legislature to a wonderful young lady whose name is Greer Adams. She's from Central Iceland here in my district and her theme was healthy relationships and so Greer made a YouTube uh, video for women and teenage girls uh, about the dangers of abusive relationships. Um, she partnered with Long Island uh, against domestic violence and and to give them supplies needed for moms and children that uh, suddenly enter their care. So Greer, I commend you uh, for someone uh, so young uh, to actually take this topic on, which is a very, very serious topic with young girls and women. And uh, to take it on 
and, 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 and do this video and show that this is something that is happening all the time. So to you, I give this certificate of achievement. I congratulate you and all the other recipients in receiving the Girl Scout Gold Award. Thank you, God bless. Hi everyone, Suffolk County Legislator Tom Silney here from the 10th Legislative District in Suffolk County. And I would like to congratulate all of this year's Girl Scout Gold Award recipients. Ladies, you're all outstanding. You all have bright futures in front of you and I wish you all the best. Thank you to everyone who's a part of the Girl Scouts organization, all of the scout leaders, certainly those in the administration for keeping these programs running. So important to the development of our young ladies. And I'd especially like to congratulate those award recipients from the 10th district. Lauren Calloway from Islip, Maggie Fleming from Islip, and Alexa Brunkeleri from Ronkonkoma. Ladies, outstanding. Keep up the great work. Good luck to each of you in your futures. Don't be strangers. Drop us a line every now and again. Let us know how you're doing. And uh, we're very proud of you. So God bless and have a great night. Good afternoon to the wonderful Girl Scouts of Suffolk County. I'm here today to congratulate all 31 of you uh, on the receipt of your gold award. I know the amount of effort that went into you girls receiving the gold award, and I am proud of you and for you. Uh, I particularly like to thank the two gold award winners that I have in my district. All of you, I think, did spectacular work, but Rebecca Hoover, thank you for working with the adaptive and special needs students at Comac and uh, teaching them how to plant seeds and paint and do pumpkins. And to Gianna Derenbacher of Lake Grove, who renovated a bird line structure um, at a children's educational camp. Wonderful, absolutely wonderful working with children. God bless you all. Have a wonderful night. I'm sorry this has to be Zoom only. Enjoy. Take care. Hello, I'm Suffolk County Legislator Rob Trot, and I'm here to congratulate Margaret, Nina, Alina, and Christina for their gold award. It's a very, very great achievement. I'm very proud of you. Continued success, and I'm sure that you can do great things in the future. So again, congratulations. Hi, I'm Suffolk County Legislator Susan Berlian. I'd like to thank the Girl Scouts of Suffolk County for inviting me to be a part of this year's Gold Award Ceremony. I wish we could all be together in person, but I'm glad we still have the opportunity to celebrate our Girl Scouts' amazing achievements. Congratulations to all of you, your parents and troop leaders on a job well done. I'm delighted to recognize three young ladies from the 16th Legislative District who completed amazing service projects in our community. Sophie Giles, she built a cell phone charging station for homeless people to use in the community. Sophie, I have a proclamation for you on behalf of the 16th Legislative District. Congratulations. Cassandra Serpico, she renovated the intake room at the Family Service League to provide storage, organization, and motivational quotes. Cassandra, I have a proclamation for you on behalf of the 16th Legislative District. Congratulations. Emily Tetlansky, she provided 100 wellness packages to the healthcare workers at Caroline Nursing and Rehabilitation Center during the pandemic. Emily, I have a proclamation for you on behalf of the 16th Legislative District. Congratulations. Sophie, Emily, Cassandra, I also have 16th Legislative District pins for each of you. Congratulations again. We are so proud of you for reaching gold, an honor that only a select you girls in scouting ever attain. You're joining the ranks of generations of young women who've made a difference both locally and globally. Can't wait to see you all again in person and to see what all of you girls will accomplish in the future. Congratulations to you and to the Girl Scout Golds recipients. All the best. Congratulations. Hi, good afternoon. Uh, my name is Suffolk County Legislator Tom Donnelly, and I just wanted to come on and take a few minutes to thank uh, Juliana Grency, who's uh, receiving her gold award. Uh, Juliana is a West Babylon uh, resident and uh, is obviously has had a great career in the Girl Scouts, culminating with her uh, achievement of the gold award. Great project that she did in, in 
building the cat shelter, the feral uh, cat shelters is really, really terrific. And as the proud dad of uh, two Cold War recipients, uh, I know how much work goes into this project and it's really, really a great uh, tribute. And it's more importantly, it's a, it's, it reflects Juliana's commitment uh, to helping others. And only 6% of the girls uh, who will start in Girl Scouts actually achieve uh, the Gold Award. Uh, and that's because of commitment. And there's no doubt that Juliana is going to continue on to be a great leader in our society. And I'm sure that we're all going to hear great things of the work of Juliana Gracie. So Juliana, once again, from uh, Tom Donnelly, the, the county legislator here in the 17th legislative district, great job. Keep up the great work. God bless. Hi, good afternoon, everybody. My name is Tom Donnelly. I'm the Suffolk County Legislator representing the 17th Legislative District, which comprises uh, parts of the town of Babylon. And I just wanted to come on and uh, take a few minutes uh, to acknowledge and to thank uh, Megan Oswald uh, for her outstanding service uh, to the Deer Park community as a member of the Deer Park Girl Scouts. Um, Megan did a really, really terrific project in renovating Deer Park High School uh, concession stand uh, as a proud uh, 1984 Deer Park graduate and somebody who played sports. I can really appreciate uh, the work that she did there. Uh, it was truly an outstanding job. But more importantly, I think it reflects Megan's commitment to making our community and our society uh, a better place. Uh, as she finishes up uh, her career at Deer Park High School uh, as a recipient of the Girl Scout Gold Award, uh, I know that we're going to hear great things uh, about Megan in years to come. So uh, to Megan and to her family, uh, congratulations. Thank you for the outstanding job that you did at the high school. But more importantly, thank you for your uh, commitment and your service uh, to the Deer Park community at lunch. Thank you. Hello, my name is legislator Dr. William Spencer. And at various times each year, the Girl Scouts of America confers its highest award for achievement on deserving members. An observation of the code of the Girl Scouts of America, I am delighted to recognize five young women in my legislative district who by their successful demonstration of their scouting achievement will be awarded the Girl Scout Gold Award. As Suffolk County legislator in the 18th district, it gives me great pride and pleasure to recognize Jenna Forstiero, Isabella Moulet, Delia Forigno, Natalie Pedrazzi, and Sophia Haskelson. Each of you has fulfilled the demanding requirements and has been instilled with a sense of duty to American citizenship, setting an example for all. Congratulations. I'm Suffolk County Sheriff Errol Toulon, Jr. I am always amazed by the incredible projects and community service contributions made by Girl Scouts in their pursuit of the prestigious Gold Award. Thank you for your hard work and please accept my heartfelt congratulations for your achievement. Your attainment of the Gold Award in Scouting says a lot about your character, commitment to improving the lives of others, and your perseverance. You should be very proud of your achievement, and I am proud of you also. Enjoy this very special day, and I wish you continued success in your life for always. Hi, this is Town of Islip Supervisor Angie Carpenter. I am so delighted to be able to be, bring greetings to all of you who have won your gold award. Suffolk County Girl Scouts have done an incredible job, and all of you have achieved the absolute pinnacle of what Girl Scouting is all about, the Gold Award. We are so very, very proud of you. And despite the fact that we're doing this virtually this year, it does not diminish the import of what you have accomplished. Congratulations. I know we'll be looking for great things from all of you in the future. Stay well. Hello, I'm Huntington Town Supervisor Chad Lubinacci, here to congratulate all the Girl Scouts who have received the Girl Scout Gold Award. The Girl Scouts of America bestows its highest award, the Gold Award, to senior Girl Scouts who demonstrate extraordinary leadership through projects that have a substantial impact on their community and beyond. To receive such a prestigious award, the Gold Award is given to a recipient who has demonstrated commitment to her community, deserving of recognition, developed a spirit of understanding and worldwide fellowship that will grow with her into adulthood with a lifetime of continued achievement. 
After many years of scouting activities and dedication to the founding principles of the Girl Scouts, these scouts have demonstrated exceptional abilities in leadership, community service, and personal development. It is with great pleasure that the Town of Huntington congratulates all of you for receiving the Girl Scout Gold Award for your tremendous work and efforts to better our communities, and we wish you well on your future endeavors. Hi, I wanted to take a moment to congratulate all of the Scouts here tonight on your Gold Award. There's something incredible about a young man or woman who can get into service, take care of all their academic and co-curricular responsibilities, and at the same time, take care of their communities and their families by doing the right things. And that's what you're all about. So I want to thank you. I want to congratulate you all for making service cool again. I want to tell you all that you are our inspiration and a special congratulations from your Wildcat family to Emily. Emily, you've made us proud. You are our gold star. Everything. Be well and continue your great work. Hi, Christine. Dr. Egan here. I wanted to send you a note to personally congratulate on achieving your gold award in Troop 1831. We are so proud of you here in Kings Park and the wonderful job that you did on the herb garden in the vegetable garden at the Sisters of St. Joseph. Service is such a huge part of the Kings Park community and thank you for playing such a large role in our efforts during your career in scouting. Take care and congratulations to you and your family. Hello, my name is Rory Matting. I'm the superintendent of schools for the Harborfield Central School District. It is my absolute pleasure to congratulate all the young women that have earned the Girl Scout Gold Award. I want to give a special congratulations to our students, Delia, Jenna, Sophia, and Isabella. I don't need to tell you what a tremendous accomplishment this is, but I hope you are extremely proud of yourselves for achieving this award, and even more so during the challenging times of a global pandemic. This celebration is your time. Hold your head up high and be proud of yourself like never before. I also want to acknowledge the families of our Gold Award recipients to thank you for your unwavering support of their journey. From our Harperfields family to yours, may you continue to be blessed with health and happiness in the future. Congratulations. Thank you so much uh, to all the dignitaries that sent in videos to congratulate our Girl Scouts. Um, and at this time, I'd like to take a moment to acknowledge those dignitaries who joined us virtually this evening. Uh, Legislator Anthony Picorello is with us. Legislator Sam Gonzalez is with us. Legislator William Spencer. Uh, Mr. Rory Manning, the superintendent for Harborfield School District and Ms. Wanda Stratham, the superintendent for Longwood School District. Thank you so much for being with us tonight and helping us celebrate our Gold Award girls. At this time, we'll be hearing directly from some of our Gold Award mentors and some of our Gold Award scouts about their projects. So let's get started. Hi, Gold Award candidates. My name is Vicki, and I'm a Gold Award mentor. Each of you has worked so hard on your projects, and it shows. You should be very proud, and we are very proud of you. Take what you've learned from this experience and bring it on to the next steps in your journey. I wish you all the best in your future. Congratulations. My name is Greer Adams. I attend SUNY Albany. For my Gold Award, I educate teens and young adults about warning signs of domestic violence and donated supplies to a local organization called the Long Island Against Domestic Violence. For my project, I learned the importance of organization and preparation as a leader. Hi, I'm Lauren Calloway, and I'm a part of Troop 1968, and I go to ISOP High School. For my Girl Scout Gold Award project, I built planters for my local American Legion, as well as planted flowers there. My Gold Award taught me a lot about leadership because as a part of the pandemic, I had to make a lot of alterations to my project. One of those being, instead of teaching girls in person, I hosted a, a Zoom call about teaching young girls how to do woodworking. Hi, my name is Maggie Fleming. I'm a senior at St. Anthony's High School. I'm a Juliet Girl Scout in Service Unit 642, and my Gold Award project was Lighthouses of Love. For my project, I refurbished the pediatric play area at Good Samaritan Hospital, and I chose a nautical theme. So I built five lighthouses, 
two life rings, and made a tile mosaic that I added to the pediatric rooftop garden. My project has helped me to identify the different needs in the community, how to use my critical thinking skills, and how to communicate better with businesses in my community. I also learned to strategize and use creativity and organization skills when doing my project. Hi, my name is Juliana Grinchy and I graduated from North Babylon High School and I'm now a student at Seton Hall University and I'm from Troop 956. For my Gold Award project, I built feral cat houses and it taught me that leadership is not always in the conventional way and sometimes you have to help animals instead of people. Hi everyone, my name is Doris. I'm a Gold Award mentor and I just wanted to congratulate you on receiving your Gold Awards. It's a fantastic accomplishment, which we are all proud of you and you should be very proud of yourselves. Congratulations again. Hi, my name is Julie Grimmore from Seth Andrew High School. I am an independent Girl Scout from Troop 66200. I built a cat shelter in order to protect feral cats from the weather and the elements, and I created an educational video on how to build a shelter like mine. I learned how to effectively relay my vision to my team members in order to achieve my goals. Thank you. My name is Maggie Marzigliano. I'm from Troop 1836 at Northport High School. For my gold award, I wanted to do something that meant a lot to me, and I'm a part of Special Olympics, so I talked to the coach and decided to donate equipment that can help them be more successful at practice, as well as donating or dedicating a mural that I painted just to raise awareness of the group itself. I had a lot of problems with this project and overall, and it really taught me how to be a leader and helped me with my leadership skills in a way that I was able to push for what I wanted. Hi, my name is Isla Mulari and I go to Harborfoods High School and I'm from Troop 355. I did my Girl Scout Gold Project on creating a more environmentally and economically sustainable garden at here at Gomset State Park. Um, my project taught me a lot about time management, planning, budgeting, and just like creating like a more sustainable space. Uh, I saved Gomset $5,000 each year and people can enjoy the garden for years to come. My name is Megan Oswald. I'm a junior at Deer Park High School and I've been a member of Troop 1163 for 12 years. To earn my Girl Scout Gold Award, I renovated the exterior of my high school concession stand. For my Gold Award project, I learned about community resources, professional painting, landscape project, execution, and time management. I'd like to congratulate the girls on their hard work and their accomplishment of Gold Award. Congratulations. Hi, my name is Cassandra Colino. I go to Snapa County Community College. I'm in Girl Scout Troop. I'm in 1953, and I worked on activity workbooks for Quad Wildlife Refuge. It taught me about how to make a timeline, how to communicate with people, and how to stay focused. Hello, my name is Natalie Pedrazzi, and I'm a senior at Harvard High School. I'm a Juliet. I volunteered with Maggie's Mission. I help spread awareness of childhood cancer in my community. I organize a month-long event each September for the past three years called Green Lung Go School. My Gold Award has taught me leadership skills by bringing awareness to the issues of childhood cancer. Hi everyone, my name is Christine Coleman and I'm from Troop 1831 and I'm currently a sophomore at St. Joseph's College and for my Gold Award project, I converted a perennial flower garden to an herb garden at the Sisters of St. Joseph's in Brentwood for the community sharing table. After this project, I've learned that anyone can do anything if they put their mind to it. Thank you. Hi, my name is Nina Ritter. I'm a junior at Northport High School and my troop number is 1470. For my Gold Award project, I painted an 18-foot mural that represented the five branches of the military and I installed a bookshelf at my local veterans hospital. This project taught me about leadership because it required me to communicate and collaborate with multiple coordinators during this pandemic. Thank you. As you can see, we have some amazing, inspiring girls here in Suffolk County, and we're so proud of all that you've accomplished in your Gold Award projects. At this time, we'd like to acknowledge the Girl Scout volunteers on our Gold Award support team who would work directly with our girls. Elena Berenblatt, Kathy Ciano, Cheryl Diagostino, Colette Galvez, Victoria Genovese, Joan Godbold, Mary Grizzle, Karen Carell, Lorraine Perez, Doris Palanish, Elizabeth Sosolsky, and Rose Vermillion. Thank you to our Gold Award support team and all those who offer their time and talent to our Gold Award girls. At this time, I'd like to take a moment to recognize that some of our Gold Award Girl Scouts have also received the Girl Scout trifecta pin. This is a special honor given to those girls in Suffolk County who have earned all three awards, the Bronze Award, the Silver Award, and now the Gold Award. 
Girls who have earned all three awards are highlighted accordingly in the upcoming slideshow. And now it's our great pleasure to recognize our exemplary 2020-2021 Gold Award Girl Scouts. Thank you again to all of our wonderful Girl Scouts and congratulations. At this time, I'd like to invite Tammy Severino, Girl Scouts of Suffolk County's Interim President and CEO to close our program. Thank you, Jackie. As we have seen, our Gold Award girls have done remarkable work. On behalf of myself, Donna Smealand, and the Girl Scouts of Suffolk County Board of Directors, I wish you all the warmest congratulations. Thank you for being such wonderful role models for all of our girls, and thank you for your extraordinary service in making the world a better place. We look forward to hearing about all of your achievements as you begin your next journey. Thank you to everyone for joining us this evening, and have a good evening. Recording stopped. Well done, Jackie, Gina Marie, Elena, Christina, Laura, you did a fabulous job. Thank you, thank you. Our girls make it easy to do a great job, but you guys put such polish on it so that we have a wonderful event for them. Thank you, amazing. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Have a good night, everyone. You as well, take care. Perfect.